No, I'm kidding. Come on man, these are only charts. So you're wondering how to turn your trading view chart into a beautiful $150 per month market smith. All for free, effortlessly and without even trying to do it by yourself? Guess what? You've come to the right place. Today you are a lucky man, or woman. I will show you how to be as close as possible to a market smith chart, and to tell the truth, no equivalent solution has been unveiled so far. To carry out this project I have coded no less than 6 indicators on TradingView whose role is to reproduce as much as possible the charts of MarketSmith while offering the closest possible results in terms of calculation accuracy, in particular for the RS rating but also for EPS and sales figures. Are you ready? Here is a quick comparison for some random charts to show you that this is in fact nearly perfect given the tools available on TradingView. But hey, this isn't perfect guys. Did you see these candles? They look perfect, right? They look gorgeous, not too thick or too thin, not too small or too big, just the way we like them, right? But look if I zoom out. And if I zoom in. You see? And it is the same for volume. But remember, on MarketSmith you can't zoom in and out, and the title of this video is how to turn into. When I first discovered that I was disappointed but after all, this is a MarketSmith-like feature. And today I almost got over it, so you can do the same. In fact for a MarketSmith like result you have nothing more to do than right click on your chart, and select reset chart. I repeat, right click and reset chart. I'm so glad about it. You will always have a good display this way. Guaranteed. Now it is time to give you all my little secret guys. I have good news for the already paying member of TradingView or for those who have a free trial period of a paying subscription plan. In order to get the same template as me you just have to go in the description and to copy and paste the link into your browser. Then click on copy and save the template. If you are a free user of TradingView, you will be able to see the template but unfortunately you won't be able to save it, but don't worry. We're going to do everything together step by step. Hand in hand? To infinity and beyond? Okay. We are now on the basic chart that you get when you create a TradingView account. Together we will perform the steps to turn your TradingView chart into a market smith one. I've done everything I can to make sure you have as few steps as possible. In fact, it's literally the indicators I've coded for you that will do all the work. So first step we are going to remove the volume indicator. Then we will modify the candle into bars in the drop down menu at the top left. The bar display is not well handled by TradingView for our purpose, right? Have you seen that when you de-zoom? Yikes. We're going to make them disappear for good. Right click on your chart, then settings and simply select their color and set their opacity to 0%. That's really nice. You don't have anything left on your chart. But hey, don't panic, you can trust me. Now let's add the SP500 line on the chart. Select the plus at the top left of the chart, then move your mouse over SPX and select New Pane. Change your color to black. Okay, you guessed it right, everything will be handled by the indicators. Head over to my GitHub link in the description to look for the indicators we'll be using. Just copy the Pine script code from the first, MarketSmith indicator. Then go to Pine editor and paste it here. Then click on save. And add to chart. Now do the same with the market smith volumes. We will also remove the labels that we can see on the right side. To do this we right click on the labels, select labels and uncheck. Indicators and financials value labels. Finally, for the last indicator I invite you to visit my TradingView profile via the link in the description. Hey now that you're here, 
feel free to boost my scripts if you like them to increase their visibility on the platform. Select the one called EPS and Sales and add the indicator to your favorites. Now go to your chart, refresh the page then add it to the chart. For this last step we will bring this last indicator to the front, follow my clicks. Congratulations! You've done it! You are the best! Between us, isn't it wonderful? And also I have a surprise for you. No I'm kidding! It's just a drawing I got you. But hey, this is not just a joke. If you want to encourage me to offer you more features like this and get us closer to paying products for free, feel free to buy me a coffee via the link in description. And also this way I would have more time to allocate to coding and I would be very happy to propose you other contents of this type or other indicators. Who knows? Why not a pattern recognition script? In any case, I wish you a great day or evening. Take care of you. And remember, never bet big until you have a proven winning system.